guys and welcome back to my channel so today <laughs> don't mind my hair so today i'm going to talk about what actually grows your butt yeah because i've heard a lot of lot of things about like growing the butt i've got lots of questions about having the big booty and my number one girls ladies Squats doesn't make your butt look so big like the Kim Kardashian or the Khloe Kardashian booty. Nope. The only thing squat does is to give you a good form. So let's say your butt is like this. Squats makes your butt go up a bit. So it gives it the perfect form. And it doesn't only just focuses on your uh, butt, it also works on your legs. When you do a lot of squats, you're going to notice that your quads, your legs are becoming more, more, more bigger because it works in general with the legs and the glutes, but focuses mostly on the legs because when you squatting, when you're going down, it, it works both on your hamstrings your cords and your glutes so never never no, don't ever think that squat grows your butt to the Khloe Kardashian butt and the other one I'm going to talk about is uh like let's say I've heard there's one that made me really laugh uh the uh the cardio kind of uh, stairs the master stairs doesn't grow your butt but it gives you a perfect perfect hamstrings and it works on your forming your glutes so one what, what makes your uh, butt really grow one hip thrusters super bomb for the glutes they pump your glutes your three muscle glutes uh, group it pumps it up so from your glute medius to your glutes maximus and your gluteus minimus it focuses mostly on your glutes so those three pair and then the other one lunges on the bench so when you have one leg on the bench and do your lunges it focuses mostly on your gluteus medius and maximus so no squats in this the other one that makes your glute like gives your glutes a pump the donkey kicks or the back kicks people call it but normally it's the donkey kicks on the bench or standing i always blend these two together so i do the donkey kicks first standing and then the second uh, donkey kicks on a bench or a sock box play and mostly I've seen many girls do this when it doesn't matter how many weights you're lifting when doing the donkey kicks the major issue on the donkey kicks you have to really focus on is how you're lifting your legs so when lifting your legs don't have your knees or uh, your knees like bent but straighten so when you lift in you go like this 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 not this this no because then it's just your ankle so here is your ankle let's say my <laughs> this is the glute and then this is your ankle so it just goes like this and you see the butt then doesn't lift up but when you straighten your leg you go and it focuses mostly on your glutes so don't ever do that and then another one that works also on pumping up the glutes and the hamstrings are the jump squats they are a super pump for your glutes so never think like oh i have to do like 200 squats no ladies no 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 the only thing like i said squat just gives you the form of your glutes and another thing ladies you can get like a Khloe kardashian bot from just working out you can work maybe for like four years you're going to have like a pump because 
when having if you want to have like the Kardashian body, you need a, a certain percent of fat in your body and especially in, in the specific area of your glutes so you need a lot of fat in your glutes to be able to form it to look like the Kim Kardashian or the Khloe Kardashians so there's no way if you have a flat to get it all big very big like the uh, Kim Kardashians no because we all know they're not real so they have uh, I'm not against uh, plastic surgery or liposuction do whatever suits you but don't lie of how you got them that's the thing that really gets me pissed off because we all know when we see the Kardashian butt it's not a gym fixed but it's a money like for suction fixed but so back to the point so if you want that kind of butt you have to go up in a certain percent of fat in the body and try and focus on your mostly your training try to focus on your glutes and trying to shred wherever you have extra fat but it's so hard for some people for new beginners to do that but we as athletes it's so easy because we can easily bump fat and we can easily build muscles so the only thing i'm i'm here trying to say here there are some people who have uh naturally fat extra fat in the glutes like i have extra fat in my glutes but when I started training, I like, focused on my whole body and I lost a bit of the fat in my butt, but I started building it back. And of course I have a big butt now, which is a big problem for me when I'm like trying to look for a gym. I mostly go for leggings or extra, extra stretch, uh, stretch uh, jeans so it can fit me because my butt is like a medium large and my legs are small. Or a medium kind of but with muscles and then my waist is an extra small like extra extra small so I'm really covered and yeah so in this case if you have the only thing I would tell you go like increase your level of carbohydrate but not so much but to a certain level like bulking so you should have a certain percent if you know what goal you're going for and try and see how you can lose your weight easily before bulking so if you want to go up uh, in the like your butt you need to eat clean and when you eat and if you bulking you have to eat clean carbohydrates not just burger kings or fast food joints no 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 that's not the fast way to bulk so you need to eat clean you can eat rice Rice is rich in uh, uh, carbohydrate. We know that you can eat your potatoes. You can eat. You can eat. There's so many variants of food in this world, but you don't need to go to like junk restaurants to just bulk. So, ladies, take this advice from me. Don't you ever, ever compare yourself with other people because everyone comes in different shapes and sizes there are some people who are lean curvy short tall not not big not so big the only thing is that when trying to find that perfect body of yours just work with consistency try and see how you're going to like reach your goal and yeah I promise you that was so go and learn read books like check the internet that's why Google is free for you ladies check 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 was good to do while training how to work your glutes muscles everything don't buy the shitty uh workout uh what they call it i see that most of the times on instagram where people are like oh i'm selling my workout plan you should buy all that and fake ladies you can never get a glutes in three weeks or six weeks no you need to know what you're eating you need to know how to curtail yourself with eating and training so you need to have the good plan but i've seen most of these workout plan when they tell you oh do like 100 squats do this do that 
ladies before you <laughs> jump into buying things like that try and gauge at what your body needs because everybody doesn't have the same immune system when it comes to building fatty cells and burning cells no so listen to what i'm saying don't buy all that just go like bodybuilding.com is the best website for like seeing learning how to improve in your workouts they're like the bomb because i remember when i started i always was there i was there i was like 24 7 <laughs> looking at their website reading stuff i got to read and even though i had you know this last year by still got i had to force myself i was like i have to like check this and that helped me a lot and try and find the like the original original fitness athletes not like the undergone surgery athletes who go and like get their butts like pumped up and they're like oh i got this through the natural process of the gym no ladies we know when you see a butt who, that's been grown through workout your whole legs will be shown with the muscles different parts of the muscles of the legs the hamstrings the cords everything you can have like a skinny leg and just have a big butt no oh. so ladies take your time and learn on how to build your body in the right way if you want to go for a surgery of course i'm not against that do that but never lie that you got it through the gym because we who work hard to get the body we have know how much the struggle you get while being at the gym and getting the compliments and the of your work of what you've gone through but not just going under the needle and then coming out to say oh i got that from the gym no just be true to yourself before you being true to others ladies so i hope this helps you guys guys and i love you see you bye thank you lovelies for watching and don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos.